I'll tell you another funny story about Cedar Belarsky. You know Cedar Belarsky. He had a good voice. He even sang for the Met at one time. Um, I, one time there was sort of a, he was performing at a benefit. My parents took me, and it was easier to take me than get a babysitter, I guess. And uh, it was a union benefit, so there were all these there was like garment workers, union people there. And the performer was going to be Cedar Berlarski singing Yiddish songs, art songs, as you know. And um, so what they were doing, they were all circulating. You know, there were all these trade union guys, and they would all go on around and schmoozing, not but schmoozing, as we say in American. And he, and he was a very, you know, sort of dignified man, and he came with a tux and a bow tie, not a, is it a tux? Yeah, a tuxedo and a bow tie, and with a handkerchief, you know. And he'd come out and he'd stand in the curve of the grand piano, and he'd look out at the audience. They paid absolutely no attention to him. They were just talking, you know, and circulating. So he got mad and he got offended, walked off the stage, came back, stood there again. Nobody paid any attention. <laughs> Walked off. Of course, it started a half hour, an hour late. You know that was standard. Anyway, and he came out several times, and finally, you know, he got really mad. And finally, he managed to get order somehow and sing his songs. But I always thought that was so funny. 